Whether it's a premium feature, an extension or plugin, software vendors often require the ability to unlock modules or components of their distributed applications. Although you could issue separate licenses for each feature, a more elegant solution would be to associate or disassociate entitlements according to each license. LicenseBring allows two types of features licensing. Features activation allows the vendor to either include or exclude specific features from a license, whereas consumption licensing allows for metered usage of a feature in the app. This can be useful if the vendor would like to limit the number of times a certain function is run or a certain report is generated, for example. Our standard plan allows up to five features of type activation to be configured in an account, while our enterprise customers can configure an unlimited number of features and can also configure consumption-based features. You can add features to any product you have added on the License Spring platform. To add a new feature to your product, navigate to the product on the platform, click on the Features tab, and then add your product features. You will then need to define a feature's name, its code, and whether it's of type activation or of type consumption. If it's a consumption-based feature, you will then specify the default number of max consumptions. You can change the default value when issuing licenses. You can associate features to a license when you issue them. Since features are dynamic entitlements, you can also add or remove them even after the license has been issued. For consumption-based features, you can change the total available consumptions at any time. This can be done either manually through the platform or programmatically by using the management API. The server returns the features that a license is entitled to when calling either the Activate License or Check License APIs or their equivalent method call from the SDK that you are using. The server response includes feature name, code, and type. For consumption-based features, the server response also includes the max consumptions, which is the initial amount available for the feature, as well as total consumptions, which is the amount that has been used. To increment total features consumptions, the SDK has a method that calls the Add Feature Consumption API. Please visit our documentation for more information on using our features licensing.